Hello and welcome back to Elgu Lab number 28. This is our seventh and it uses four modules instead of the one from the last lab. So let's go ahead and take a look and see how this runs down. Okay and this is our lab right now where it's starting from zero and counting down from nine. And as you can see here there's actually a multiple number of um, male to male wires that go between our board here and into the breadboard. Now I'm going to go ahead and leave the description of how this got wired up because since it wasn't on my disk I don't want anyone else to struggle with this experiment. But as you can see here I've got my red wire which is connected to the 5 volts which is connected to here for power to the chip. Our two grounds here where one goes over near where the chip is, and this other one goes to ground for our display. And I have a green, a red, and a yellow wire that all interconnect to where my chip is. Now my chip is a 95 chip that's included in the kit. And you have to really pay attention to where the different wires hook up to the segments on that chip. I had some difficulty making sure that the grounds were wired correctly. What I have on here is I have four resistors and they all have their own um, power which comes off of the black wire from the Uno R3 and then they're helping to go power the different parts of the segment right here. The orange, green, and white wires that you see and then the bottom wires and the top wires all go to the chip over here, our 95 chip. So I will be leaving um, as complete instructions in the description as I can to make this make sense so that you understand how I got to this point and how the other mechatronics um, experimenter got to this point as well. I want to make sure that you're able to do this lab. So thank you for tuning in, um, more to follow.